everyone this is Kakur Bernard today I will be taking you through desktop publishing what you normally call publisher and today we shall look at how to design a business card using this question guide and so remember to subscribe to my youtube channel for more videos that will be loading here on youtube and so this question says that we are going to design a business card and so what are they saying on saving? That we save this publication as able and our names and personal number. So this means that now we are going to create a folder where we shall save this work. So we create a folder in our names. After creating a folder, open it inside create a publisher document microsoft publisher document that we call it able hyphen put your names and then your personal number 573 so you open it so once it has opened we are supposed to design a business card so our publisher document has opened and so this means that we are supposed to adjust it and make sure that it is now a business card. So the question says, in each of the following spaces, you are going to design identical business cards with the following details. You are advised to use appropriate formatting and positioning of the details below to make your card fit in the space created. Design 8 identical borders business card tiled on portrait A4 page size 3.5 width and 2 height the, deep, the card layout and spacing is as follows left and right margins to be 0 0.5 top and bottom margins 0 0.7 the vertical and horizontal gap between the card 0 0.6 so after publisher has opened we now come to page design we click change template and so from change template when you click here you now have to choose a variety of what we have here and so from there we need business cards so click home and so click business cards so double click on business cards so from these business cards the question is telling us to use borders design so scroll down and so double click borders business card so when you click borders business card it is here and now we are going to adjust it and make sure that everything is fitting here so we come to page setup so click the ribbon launcher on page setup so after clicking here we come to paper size they have told us we choose a4 and so here width to 3.5 and height to which is okay and then margin guides top top they want us to have 0 0.7 left and right 0 0.5 bottom also 0 0.7 right is the same as left 0 0.5 then again here side margins is left and right so side margins left right 0 0.5 top was supposed to be 0 0.7 horizontal gap they told us horizontal gap is 0 0.6 and also vertical is 0 0.6 and so after doing this we are supposed to be having eight identical cards when we click ok and so when you go back to save changes so when i click file print these are the eight identical business cards that we shall need to follow. So copies of each is supposed to be 
8 like that and this 8 should be on a 4 so these are our 8 identical business cards so we save changes and now we go ahead to design that after adjusting it insert the picture actors your logo so we are going to insert a picture here so you click here and remove these designs so we go to insert picture desktop support files so images search for able able logo is here remember we are using support files for these numbers so you go there insert your picture there to act as a logo so after putting your image instructions say adjust the size of the image maintaining the aspect ratio so when you are adjusting for it to fit in the space insert company name as Evilunji Virga Omtut Sako Limited Kasaka Branch so here we put Evilunji Virga Omtut Sako Kasaka Branch Yes, and so make it pink in color. So you highlight it under color. You can choose, you can even choose color of your choice from these font colors. So if I choose it to be green, it is okay because we need you to have changed the color and use use your name and registration number as the owner of the card so from here you can put my names and then my personal number 573 then they continue to say telephone number is here so we shall come here and change that telephone number we say plus two five six put the telephone number there fax you can leave it and then when you look at email email has been uh, covered you need to expand so that you can see the email but meanwhile we need to reduce font size here so click here and press ctrl a you come here and choose font size six and then this email they are telling us that we put ebosako at kasaka.co.ug so here we put ebosako kasaka at ebo at kasaka it is at kasaka dot at kasaka dot ac dot ug and so that is our email then from there address po box at a sleeve chain so you can come here select all you say p dot o o dot box that the three of change you press enter and then you add the of change main street so that is the address where you can find us and so we are putting everything like that then they are telling us that uh, 
insert your name and index number in the footer. So before that, your title in the company, I've put your names, what is your title in the company? Are you the managing director, sales manager, or you are the marketing manager? So you can say loans officer as my title in Ebo Circle. So as simple as that, you have designed a business card. So let's put a footer. So under insert, you come to head and footer, click footer. So from here, put your names. Can put my names. And so you click on close. When you see here, I don't see my footer. So this means that I have to make sure that the footer is seen. How? Go back to insert footer and so drag this move it down around there close master page and so here is your footer so when you click five this is your footer when you click file print these are your eight identical business cards i said in case you get a challenge click here Copies of page, you put them there, A4, portrait, save changes, and so you can print. So that marks the end of today's number. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe to my YouTube channel, I'm Kakur Bernard. And in case you need support files, my numbers are there below. Contact me. Goodbye.